medium dark. Last week, I was happily scrolling through Facebook lah, and then suddenly, I saw this ad by a drugstore beauty brand. It's for one of their foundation line, and they were all like, Oh my god, look at us! We have so many shades! Now all of you can have the perfect match lah. And guess what is their darker shade? <laughs> Guys, I'm not even that dark lah, comparatively speaking. There are people living in this country using beauty products huh, who are at least three to five shades darker than me. But all these drugstore beauty brands that are sold here huh, stop at like 10 shades lighter than me. They only have three shades usually. Fair, medium, dark. Who's fair? Who's medium? Who's dark? Upper knee, 50 shades of beige. Excuse me, hello, this is 10. What? How is this 10? Hello? And all the international drugstore beauty brands that actually have a wide range of foundation shades don't sell them in our country. And when we ask them why they don't sell these dark shades of foundation here, they always say, not that many dark skinned people living in this country. La. And the ones who live here, not like they buy beauty products anyway. <sighs> Muruga, Allah, Jesus, Buddha, please give me patience to deal with these people. Krishna Hari. I know, I know, there are not that many dark skinned people living in this country. But news flash, we exist. So stock up accordingly, la. test the market. You never test. How you know? You psychic, huh? I'm kind of psychic. I guarantee you, if you sell these dark shades here, right? Dark skinned Malaysians will buy it. They will be so happy. You will make money. Rich bitch. Because right now, we don't have a choice. Because if we want to use makeup, we got to go to Sephora or buy online and spend a shit ton of money. Money that sometimes we don't have. Money that sometimes we don't have. That sometimes we don't have. All this problem, because apparently, dark skinned people don't like makeup. I am offended. Business developers for drugstore beauty brands in Malaysia have decided for us. We don't buy makeup. Interesting, very interesting. Hey, hey, who hired your business developers? Huh? Fire them. Consult me. Uh, my contact details is on my Instagram. Huh? Anyway, employees of international beauty brands that only choose to sell lighter shades of foundation here. What made you think we won't buy it? Huh? Why else do you think we end up in Sephora? Ha! Do not tell me. People are so sensitive nowadays. Shut up, big fat lady. No matter what, you're just ugly. Buy online or just buy from other brands lah. Ah, uh, why yes, yes, I am sensitive. I am sensitive to bullshit. This is a real problem, okay? It's mission to colonize, exploit. Stop trivializing it by just calling it a rent. Oh, I am wearing the NYX uh, Can't Stop, Won't Stop foundation in Deep Sable. I think it's 89 ringgit. But uh, some months, right, I really I really don't want to spend 89 ringgit. I want to spend less than 50 ringgit. And there are drugstore foundations that, you know, retail for like less than 50 ringgit. But um, guess what's the problem? They just come in. Five shades of ivory. Problems, problems. I got 99 problems, but a b ain't one. Anyway, as for the Malaysian brands, hey, wait, this one not sponsored posts. Uh, I really wanna um just give a shout out to Nita Cosmetics for like leading the way with 15 shades of foundation. Great job, good one. I hope next year you have 30 foundation shades. As for the rest of you. Step up your game. Fill the gap in the market for good quality foundations that come in a wide range of shades. Because there's more than just five shades of beige in this country. Wow, look. Beige. Many beige. So many options. Shouldn't I be grateful?